Again, the university and Bath Rugby have helped to put on a very good occasion and uh, yeah, I'm just really sorry we couldn't uh, seal it off with a win. Yeah, it was just some, some things that we think were in our control that we didn't get right that, that sort of we think cost us a bit, so it's frustrating, mm -hmm. I think. And it was 2012 when uh, we, we got up close to the line and, and, and spilled the ball and then they got a line out of penalty and then went down the other end and scored. It's sort of a bit of a momentum changer. <laughs> so yeah, it, frustrating but saying that we're, we're getting better. We're getting better at some of our performances. Um, but we'll keep looking at the things that we can control. I think at half time we were probably where we wanted to be. Um, we finished the half quite strongly. Um, we thought the game was within our grasp and then sadly we just couldn't convert on our opportunities in the second half. Uh, if we look back at how the season started, I said to the boys we wouldn't have lost 31-0 to Durham if we played them today, we would have beaten Durham. We're moving in the right direction and we're close which is why it's so frustrating when we come away with games like today. Pleased to, to remember George Stevenson, um, yeah, a bit of an emotional time. Uh, George George was pivotal to our club uh, and, and, and sort of epitomised you know, what, what this club's about, really good guy. It's always nice to play in front of a big crowd, especially down at the rec. Uh, it's always a special occasion and tonight definitely was one of those days. An ISIS icon, um, Investigo, uh, we've got to thank their, their, their sponsors, um, you know, brilliant. We're, the, the support they give us is, 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 is really good and um, we can't thank them enough.